I don't care. I say it once and I'll say it again. Single should not be around to Shay like dot dot dot. Him and his fam used to look down on him. They had zero respect for that man. Now he has a little emotion. Um, everybody wants to mess with him, not to mention the breakup with Brooklyn. It's too close for comfort. Like why associate uh, like why associate yourself with the people that brought you the most pain? Question mark. It's okay to forgive people. Who did you dirty and respectfully keep your distance? The Shay knows exactly what he's trying to create between Cinco and Brooklyn Queen. Dude is not his friend. The Shay always makes Cinco look dumb and Cinco always fall for it. Boss up Cinco. We in secondhand embarrassment looking at this stuff. Okay. So these are y'all. These are the key texts. This is what y'all, some of the comments that you guys left on my last video. And y'all was going in on Deshay. Y'all went in on Deshay so bad that in, wait, where is that? This, this live that we're going to take a look at later. Jason Cole said that he's done doing content with Deshay because he was, Deshay was egging on the drama and, Deshae, and Jason Cole don't like the drama. He don't like the toxic comments. So hey, bro, in, in this clip, he, um, addresses the comments let's take a listen hey bro and yeah what i don't be understanding is the same things i'm doing like drink like i said drinking you know if i smoke a blunt or something or if i hang out with girls and I, you know i'm like i don't even want to say like i guess you could say getting on girls and shit like because i'm doing that people are talking about like it's the it's the fall of me. Not even people because not a majority thing. It's just little, I'm just speaking to the little people. I'm speaking to the little little amount, bro. These are things off camera. I'm doing any way, anyway. I'm just allowing you all to see it so I can be able to be open. That's what, like me, bro. I'm a very open person when it comes to internet stuff. You feel me? Because I like to be so. I like to be so transparent with my subscribers or my supporters that I don't have to fake nothing for a camera. A lot of these niggas fake stuff for it's a lot of big celebrities that fake for a camera. And I know them personally. They act like they don't do certain things like I understand the image part, but I think that you're gonna have to accept me for who I am, bro. I'm not never finna be living no Hannah Montana life. You feel me? I'm gonna be who I am on and off camera, bro. If I wake up and be another nigga, you're gonna see me wake up and be another nigga tomorrow. You feel me? I'm not finna Transition slowly. Nah, nah, nigga, you gonna see, you gonna see it, bro. You gonna see it, bro. That's just how real I am with my people. You feel me? And people don't understand from Compton, bro. You feel me? Like we, it's two more clips that we're gonna look at from the Jay Cinco addressing the comments. But I just got a question: Who is this young lady? It say Jay Cinco says he found his wife. Is this your new joint? Bet. I'm so like how, LeBron James. Tell him what you you with your wife. Yeah, oh my wife, you gotta show me. You gotta show me, you gonna show me? Probably. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna show you. You gonna show me? Mm hmm. I'm for real. Really, that one, okay? Yeah. Y'all don't know this, but he got me this, okay? <laughs> I did. He did. I did, I did. One of them ones, okay? She gonna, she gonna put on me her, her, her material tonight. Mm hmm. She gonna put on me tonight? Mm hmm. <laughs> Slam, what you got to say? Start on me. Is this a prank? Was that a prank? Was that real? Was that AI? But um, just kidding, guys. Just kidding. We're gonna um take a look at the rest of the addressing the comments. It's a bro. I am fed up. Like I'm, I, the person I am. I am who I am. You feel me? People, bro. It's people younger than me going out drinking every day. You'll be going out drinking every day. You'll be going out dancing. Like, come on, bro. Like, you feel me? All my young niggas do this shit every day. You feel me? Like, all my homies do this shit. They chill. They outside. We chill. We outside. We young. We 22. Niggas, but, but, when, but niggas want me to get married. Like, niggas say, bro, oh, nigga, I'm 22 years old. And niggas want me to get married already, bro. Like that, that like, when I see shit like that, like, it be like, okay, I see what could be coming, where people could be coming from. 
What I said, yeah, that's what be blowing me. Like, niggas swear I can, I'm supposed to get married. Like, they, it's okay for me to get married like I'm 27. Like, I'm doing this shit at an old age. Bro, I'm doing this at 22. I've been in a relationship since I was 18, bro. 19. I was in a relationship since I was 19, bro. I'm 22. I was in a relationship for two and a half years. No fun. As far as, like, don't get me wrong, relationship. It was good, you feel me? I, I, I loved my relationship. Don't get me wrong, I had some great times. I'm just speaking as far as fun, because it was toxic, you feel me? It was toxic as hell. So. This is the final clip, y'all. This is the final clip of the addressing the comments, and then if y'all want to take a look at the live, I'll, I'll insert that as well. You guys, let me know what y'all think about all this so far in the comment section. When I was reading y'all comments, you guys felt some type of way because um so in my last video i said that the did not diss brooklyn queen but then i seen a comment that said the called her a hoe and then you guys are upset that jay Cinco did not defend brooklyn on that stream am i correct i was going fine i was financially unstable you feel me like like check to check you feel me um you know, I cut my hair. I lost all my confidence. You feel me? I went through depression with that. Went through depression with my breakup. Went through depression with after my breakup. You feel me? Went through a lot of these things. Went through a lot of stuff, bro. A lot of stuff. And it, yeah, I gotta understand. Like, like somebody compared me, and this is no diss to bro. Somebody compared me to to Quan. You know what I'm saying? No diss to bro. Me and bro grew up two different ways and, and two different sides of the world. You feel what I'm saying? He not he wasn't living how I was living. As far as like his environment may not have been my environment. Like maybe, you feel me? Like it shaped him to be somebody different. He got his own thing going on. That's good for bro. You feel me? Everybody's different. Like like trying to put me in lanes with other people. I'm not in my, with other people, bro. Bro is in his own lane. I'm in my own lane. I'm, do, I'm, I'm who I am. You feel me? So like, you know, like I don't be understanding, bro. I don't be getting it, bro. I was, I was. They said boohoo. Look at the comments. Y'all is ruthless. Boohoo. And then this is my question. Who is Quan? Quan is the dude that, um, Brooklyn Frost. Was it Brooklyn Frost? They had, did like a video. They did a video together. That Quan or somebody else? Nah, yeah. That... Nah, yeah, nah. No more, no more content, man. No more. I can't. I, I just, I kind of made, I kind of made the decision. No more content, even more, bro. You know, it's love, yo. It just isn't, it just isn't in my best interest. <laughs> it sounds like I'm committed to a, a college. Oh, yeah, but you feel me? It's all good. It's a, you live and you learn, my, you know. You live and you learn, my brother. You live and you learn. You very. But yeah, it was just you know, it's, you know me. I don't do drama, bro. You feel me? I don't do drama, bro. You feel me? So it's like, you know, when you egg drama on, it's kind of like ah, it's not my cup of tea. You feel me? I don't like drama, bro. Cause I hate, I hate toxicity. I hate the comments. I hate all that. My Snapchat? Oh nah, nah. That don't mean that don't mean I'm regretting anything I do on my Snapchat. I'm just saying, on the messy end. You said I was doing too much on the yams? So what? What are you supposed to do on the yams? If you ain't go to the yams and turn up, what was you really in the yams for? Touring? Wish I would be touring the yams. I go to Santa Monica. You been a shark. You know I'm a shark. I ain't gonna lie though, Miami, bro, I said this constantly though. Miami, it changed my view on life, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Ever since I went to Miami, I've been the happiest I've ever been, bro. My Snapchat is IMJ505. But now nah, I've been the happiest I've ever been, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I've really been the happiest I've ever been. But I'm not doing no more videos with bro. Just because, you know, I don't like that. You feel me? Not saying I don't mean I don't put bro, but I just, I'm mean just, you know, I'm not a drama to you, feel me? I feel like. That put me in that put me in a bad light, and I don't like that. 
You feel me? So, you know, at the end of the day, you know, everybody, everybody felt the way and went off. Like when I went to Miami, my, my first day, everybody was like, bro, we love, we love how these girls are coming up to you. It's crazy. You're enjoying yourself. You feel me? Everybody loved it. After a little, I'm talking to everybody down in my content, talking crazy about my content. Da -da 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 -da. I'm like, damn, for real? That's how y'all feel? Cool. I got you. Nah, I'm on bro. I'm like, I got you. Y'all seen, y'all seen people? My mama. Cause me, I'm gonna keep going up. No matter what, I'm gonna keep going up. So, keep that same energy. Keep that same energy. Why y'all saying change it? I'm not being messy, bro. Literally being the most, I literally just being a uh, grown, like grown about it. So you know, not gonna, you know. Oh, bro, that's not nothing bad, bro. It's just you feel me. I'm just saying, bro. I'd rather just say it so people just know and just don't be like, oh, why you don't? You feel me? I'm just saying. You know? Just gotta chill from that. That's all. So cool. But a lot of people just didn't really realize, like, yeah, I was drunk, bro. I feel like a lot of people are ruling that out, like I wasn't. Like I was in my right state of mind. Like I was in this state of mind right here. Like very attentive. So I ain't gonna lie. I did get, I, that was my second, what's my second time? Yeah. My first time was in Miami. I mean, that was my second time. Man, ain't nobody making no excuses, bro. I'm a girl, man, bro. At the end of the day, whatever I do, bro, is what I do, bro. You feel me? I don't never, I don't regret nothing. I don't make excuses for nothing. Nothing, bro. I'm a grown man, bro. You know, I'm just not with the drama, bro. You feel me? I take everything. Yeah, but it's cool though. I ain't tripping. It ain't nothing. It's just, you know, I knew it was gonna happen. I said it was gonna, it was gonna get be bigger than what it was. You know, that's why I didn't want to really respond or feed into it. Cause I'm like, man, it's just gonna make it bigger than what it is, man. But you know, it did what it did. We ain't chilling. We ain't chilling. God know my heart. I know my heart. Naturally, I'm at pe I'm at peace with myself. I know. I need to edit this video though. We won't leave it till another 50 minutes. I'm gonna edit this video. Nah, nah, the way people was mad that I was dancing with females was crazy, bro. Was crazy, bro. Was crazy. I, I was like, bro, damn, somebody was like, he's losing his self. <laughs> somebody, people was like, he's losing his self. They're like, he's losing his self. He's um get, he's they said you're giving your money away. I'm like, bro, I am just playing, bro. I am just dancing with girls, bro. Like, you know, I, I ain't even, like even the other day with the, if y'all was on my snap, we should go follow my snap. You feel me? But even on my snap, bro. Um, what I do on my snap? I had them two girls in Atlanta. Bro, I didn't know it was, bro. People make it seem like I'm just everybody I'm with. Bro, I literally was just popping it. For me, I just literally be giving y'all a show. Like, I just be like, let me entertain my snap. Let me pull out my snap. You feel me? Even, like, girls asking me to kiss them. I'm not kissing no girl. I don't give a damn how, how I am. I ain't kissing no girl. So I'm just entertaining y'all. You, you don't say you don't want your channel to be that. Nah, facts. I mean, we, no, look. I don't mind my content being with girls. I don't mind that. Because at the end of the day, bro, I'm older. You got to understand, I'm 22. So, content with girls... It's cool. I love girls. You know? I love girls. So I really don't be tripping. It just more so be like, 
I don't want my, my 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 page to be somewhere where I can't collab with other people because it's like it can get so toxic. You know what I'm saying? That's all. That's what I don't want. I don't mind the girl content. Just maybe not too much of it. You feel me? Just vlogs. I use a girl in it for a little clickbait or something.